And the last kind of foundational question before we get into tactics would be, we just talked so much about prevention and the importance of it, which if anyone who is younger listening, hopefully encourages them to kind of play that longer game. But what about someone who's older? So they just heard you talk about prevention, the importance of it, and they might be thinking to themselves, you know, I wonder if it's too late for me to start thinking about my longevity. What would you say to that? Well, I mean, I think there's like the theoretical answer and the practical answer, right? I mean, I think the theoretical answer is, look, while you still have, you know, breath in your lungs, it's not too late to do something. But I also think um, that we're all in a car driving towards the edge of a cliff. And it's a lot easier to slow the car down and make sure that you either avoid the cliff altogether or at a minimum, you know, r slow your route to the cliff's edge dramatically if you begin the slowing process before you get there. In other words, everybody understands that when you see a red light, you have to be applying the brakes before you reach the actual light. So at some point, I think it is very difficult to, um, to, to back out of a situation. But I also think that that's the rare exception and not the rule. So, uh, you know, I, I've even in the book written about uh, individuals who are in their 70s before they take their first committed step towards health. And these are individuals that in their 80s now are doing better than they were in their 60s from a health perspective, from a movement perspective. So um, I would absolutely hope that a person listening to us in what might be thought of as their twilight years, who's thinking, man, I wish I did something about this sooner. Is it too late? I would say it's not too late. Um, you'll have to make concessions. You need to start slower. You need to make sure you're not getting injured. I mean, there's an entire playbook and we actually have a podcast around this episode, uh, this topic specifically around, you know, what, what would, what would an exercise program for the elderly look like? Um, but you know, I definitely would be, um, very disappointed that if, if, if anyone thought I was communicating that, uh, once you reach a certain age, it's sort of all bets are off and. 